Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, Namaste, Apkesehe. <laughs> it is a great honor to be here today. I came from a very small country, his, uh, which has a long traditional textile industry. Textile industry is the fourth export branch of Serbia. In this section, operates uh, 2,000 uh, 2, companies. We are small countries, and it's uh, very good for all the countries with 7 million people. Today, I will speak about importance of mapping of development of fashion company business strategy. With the development of market and increased competition, there are many fashion products who want to sell those products and improve on the world market. Customer tests have been extremely sophisticated, being allowed the modern technologies, opting high quality products and service, very easy at low price everywhere in the law. Government products are focused to be even more initiatives in the fields of innovations and third, reduction of operation cost. There is a, not a single strategy that would be optimal for the all companies. This is a big problem. Strategic planning is a long and complex process in which there is no guarantee that the government produce will achieve desired goals. Strategic planning is a process which includes all we know that perception of market conditions, customer needs, competitive strengths and weakness, developments, legal and economical conditions, and so on. In addition to the analyze of the general environment, the fashion company must analyze the business environment and internal organization. Strategic, strategic map can help to overcome this difficult journey. Strategic map is like a road and uh, provide employees with a clear image about the connection between their jobs and the another one's value which must be increased over doing their jobs and good as possible. The most important direction for increasing the innovativeness and effectiveness of employees, uh, process, activities of the companies. Strategy mapping and management and this is company with four uh, key activities. First is define strategic objectives. Second is implementing strategic goals through the balance scorecard. You may see on the pictures the, that implementation. Third is focusing of key strategic objectives. And four is connecting strategic management with support functions. The first perspective for strategic mapping is learning and grow. This per uh, perspective defines three categories necessary to implement the strategy for companies. First is, of course, strategic, com uh, strategic competence, all skills, all knowledge necessary to employees. Second is strategic technology. That means first information system like 3D, CAD, product, product life cycle management softwares, database and methods necessary to support the strategy. Third is organization climate. The cultural changes that will provide motivation and training, training for performing a definite uh, strategy. About this we are heard uh, today. Internal process defines pr uh, business process, uh, specific activities 
which our organization must introduce and implement in order to meet all the values for the customer. That is first uh, innovation process, of course development of fashion products, the speed of delivering to the market. Second is process of managing customers like development of solution, service, uh, customer relationship management, operation process like supply uh, chain management, reduce cost, improving quality, uh, reduce production cycle time, uh, better capacity management, ergonomic workplace and so on. And cost process related to the environment, uh, health, safety, and another. Customer perspective is the core of the strategy. It shows how and what direction the company grows should be achieved. The most important thing for the customer is design of the fashion product, product quality, delivery time, price, and image of company on the market. Financial perspective is created value for the owners, of course. On this slide, you can see the example of the strategy map. We ob uh, observed uh, five objectives and uh, criteria for each objectives. We uh, objectives are reducing producing costs, uh, then improving technology process, speed of process, using the basic results, and effectively working capital. For the formulating a strategy based on the strategic map, we have six steps. First step is the development of strategy. For development of strategy, it is necessary that the management of company should first define the mission, vision, and value of company. Second is strategic analyze. That means external environment like political, economical, social, technological, legal, ex uh, internal environment like human resources, capital, technology, key process and of course existing strategy, current situation and problems with them. For this uh, we can use simple methods like PEST or SWOT analysis. On this slide you can see the SWOT analysis one of the uh, fashion company in Serbia. It's a company with very long traditional, with futuric design, with good image on the market. Uh, they use the quality textile fabrics, but uh, weakness is uh, generally a problem in my country. We, have, we are a small country and we have just a little series, little orders, manufacturing only three, four sites for fashion. But opportunity for us and for all company in all world is customers wish for new design. Uh, making the products into the new markets, making uh, email catalogs, value of length, uh, made to measure is very important for garment industry. I think in, uh, very important in the, our future. Uh, promote technology transfer and so on. Threats are every, everywhere is the same. For uh, development of strategy, necessary is uh, create a strategy. Define the market segment in which to focus company activities. Determine the value of, of customer. Uh, Define key process, find the human resource necessary for implementation. Uh, then we must uh, get a new technology to able to choose a uh, uh, strategy. Sorry. Planning a strategy is a second step. In this step, company develops a strategic map. The objective contained in map and topics and, devel uh, and 
divide into the objectives and criteria of balanced scorecard, define strategic initiatives, defines strategic plans, which predicts how the financial strategy invites in various business function and creative team for all of that. In order to adjust the organization to the strategy, it is necessary to pay attention on the following. First, is strategy is usually carried out at the level of business, and management must make strategy map as cascade. Second is uh, in every uh, unit, business unit, we have support unit. Uh, so the management needs to ensure their compliance with the company uh, strategy. And uh, employees are always the ones who carry out the strategy. And they need to understand this strategy. Another steps for formulating strategy are, of course, planning operation, monitoring, learning, testing, and adaptation of strategy. On the basis of the strategic management and strategic map, the strategy of fashion company is formulated. On this slide, you can see the, the steps for, uh, for a strategic map. Uh, it's very important to get our strategic uh, for fashion. It's, you see the steps, like a road, is very simple at all to, uh, to got a good strategy. We have uh, another simple tool, is a strategic group mapping. It's a technique to display different market and comparative position uh, of rival companies. Is a tool to understanding the similars and difference, strengths and weakness. We are comparing like price, quality, uh, product portfolio, uh, distribution channels, and so on. You have an example on the, this slide. And finally, we conclude. The strategic map is the logical and overall architecture for the description of strategy. The basic of strategy map are competence of all employers, applied modern technology and organization culture. In this infrastructure, support for the use of internal resource, meeting the needs of customers and make it profit for all the companies. The strategy map ensures that the vision and strategy are transferred into the system on, of objectives and criteria which they allow regular monitoring and measuring of the realization. It measures not only the current value of company as is, but also its ability to create the value of the uh, future. Good business strategy is very important for all the companies. So every day we must learn about new methods, new technology and innovations. Only a quality product with good price has a, a place in the market. I know the uh, textile industry of India is a great future in the uh, textile industry. This conference is very important for all of us to learn together. Only together we are one big textile family. Thanks Textile Association from my heart. Dear colleagues, thank you for your attentions.